Okay, the world is now updated to Minecraft Infodev 2010-06-18. This is the first secret Minecraft update. And you wonder what this update added? I show you. Wall and sand. And <coughs> sand suffocation. That's the main feature of this update. Just kidding. This update also added something else as well. There's something else. It's like one of the main, more, more iconic features of Minecraft. It has mine in its name. And you remember the recipes I showed you in a previous episode? This chess? Yes, but also this chess. Time to craft the new thing that was introduced in the secret update. Black wine. That's the new feature of the secret update. A black curve. That's it. Secret update's over. Just kidding. It's actually a minecart. Let me just craft about five of them. But before I place down the minecart, I'll like to craft some whales. Let me just empty my inventory. Okay, you can't have minecart without whales. And for one craft recipe, you get 16 rails for 6 iron. So that will create 4 stacks of rails. Let's test it. I'm going to test the minecart and rails here. And do you think you might ride minecart in this version? No, it's like a minecart with a chest. And you're wondering what I'm going to throw the minecart with something nice and easy that fills up all the space from the chest. Poor chops. When you click on the minecart, you can put stuff in like those poor chops. And when you put stuff in, it shows a bit of dirt of the amount of stuff that's in the minecart. And I click on it again, and I fill up more. And with the weapon swats in the chest, in the minecart, I meant to say, it's not a minecart with chest. Mine cart meant for storing and with store stuff in this update not providing yet and look that patch of dirt got a bit bigger and let me just put more pork chops in. Okay, 19 slots filled and you see the dirt is even bigger. I made the pork chops from this chest. The mine cart is now filled and you should see the dirt is now at the top. And can I destroy your mine cart? I can't. My cart for undesirable with stuff in. And this. Undesirable. So once you place it, it's there forever. You can't man it. How can you even destroy your minecart? Seems like you're just there forever. I just want to make a look all like right circle and track for the minecart to go through. I just want to push them. I don't seem to have much speed, like when I just push a rim. One bad thing about those versions is there's no power rails, so how my cars used to make up with speed is off hills. So let me just try this hill. I'm gonna be introducing a third minecart to the track. That wasn't much speed. It just went out. Oh, it's good to know when you place like a minecart on the door, it doesn't place the minecart. That's good. And I think the doors look slightly different in the last version, or is it just me? I think I hear a couple of pigs out. Yeah. No poor chops off that. Bad work. No poor chops up that. Worse work. And I wonder where to do more experiments with minecarts. <laughs> you can't 
can't place minecarts how the way I want. <laughs> uh, those versions were a bit buggy. <laughs> That's kind of unusual. Minecraft was crazy back in the day. I wonder how do I create a Minecraft booster? No. Thus, no. But maybe if I did it that way, it'd be fine. It's turn night, I'm not worrying. But one, two. Where did that torch go? Did the torch just disappear? I think I don't have the replacement. I'm just going to rush back in and get myself a torch. I found some sticks, but not some coal. But I know where coal is. Not on this chest. I must remove it all to my ore chest. Yeah, coal's in this chest. Place torch here. And I think I'm just going to skip until I successfully make a minecart booster track. Alpha version, sure not. Yet, okay, I'm just going to pull away my tracks and I decided not to mess with minecarts much this, in this episode because minecarts are just very stupid and I can't really control the tracks so maybe I'll mess with the minecart in a later episode but let's see. I put stuff in the minecart just to see what the later updates will mess with. I'm just going to pull away the tracks in this chest. Of course, because that's my iron chest. I think in this episode, instead of making like a minecart system because that doesn't really work yet, let's make a tree farm because we will need one of those. And let me just save for dirt because you can't have a tree farm without dirt. Good. And these saplings for the trees. And what I am missing, I find out. I like to go with the flow, man. When I need it, I just go back to the house. That's just how I play Minecraft. Where can I build my tree farm? Oh, four sheep just spawned. More cloth. I think I'll make one of the corners of the farm here. And the other corner of the farm will be here. Yeah, that's how big I want the farm to be. And I'm going to cover all sides with, should I do it with cobblestone or stone slabs? I like stone slabs. What can I place the crafting table there to get myself stone slabs? Okay, the stone slabs now crafted. Now it's time to do the platform. Right, the bottom ones will be like cobblestone, but the top bit will be stone slabs. <laughs> Doesn't matter. I'm just seeing how the wall, the wall look, and I think the wall looks good. But I need a bridge to get in the middle, so I wonder where we'll place it. I don't even know how big it is. I think maybe here. That's six. That's five. Five times five. Yeah, that's good. Build the bridge to wood farm here. Lighten it up a bit. Some temporary torches. Or maybe we're permanent, I don't know yet. Now, I hate placing cobblestone in the wrong place underwater. Like, once you're drowning, you keep getting knocked back underwater, so drowning's every bad in this version. Yeah, I wanna be a bit wrong, and. Is it just me? Or the game does crashed. No, it does like lag for a second. That's a bit weird. But well, I'd not know to start switch to wood. Silly me. But that was crazy that like the whole lag thing for about two whole seconds. Are you kidding me? Minecraft is supposed to be very smooth on this computer. Working in modern versions, I don't have to deal with that. Well, modern versions, you have lower FPS, so... Oh, well. I think maybe, like, Minecraft 1.12 or Minecraft 1.8 was the sweet spot 
because this is where you had the greatest performance and the game won well as well but I feel like in like Roads and Pillage, the Never Update and like since Update Aquatic that's how long it's been going for the game runs a bit worse but has more features now and it's a better game. Last bit, stack of cobble, I hope I make it. Of course I'm gonna make it because not that much space to left to fill in. Okay, time to use the stone slabs. Does it make me up a mistake? I meant to fill with that with wood. Simple fix. The outline of the tree farm is now done and I think I'm gonna need a lot more stone slabs than I think. And I've got much durability left, so let's see if I can kill all those pigs. No I can't, I need to craft another one. Pigs still spawning in the house. You won't be doing that for much longer. Time to film the farm. But first, I want to see where the plate to dirt. One every way three blocks are good, so one here, one, two, three, one there, one, two, three, and one there. That's good. Mobs don't spawn in water, so I don't need to cover all up with water. I have nothing to worry about that water. Maybe it's dark under there, but mobs don't spawn in water anyway. Oops. That's just gone forever. You just got upset water sometimes. If I fall off, I probably need to destroy one of those stone slab blocks. And I guess let's throw it. So, just to be safe, I think I need to craft myself one ladder to help me get myself out. Are you kidding me? Good. Damn it! That was two half slabs lost forever. Do we even have enough? Maybe. The trees have like one, two, three space, so I gave the trees plenty of room to grow. You can grow like oak trees right by each other, but you don't get as much leaves as you like. This is like the perfect distance to grow trees. Oh no, it's turn night. I think we need to place the torches. Okay, this torch was there, so I'll place it here. There. 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 Yeah. No, I didn't place from wrong. It does start placed a torch there. I forgot to place it there. What the heck? Silly. Good. I don't think I have enough swabs to finish it off. That was close for falling off. Minecraft used to be so scary. Like it's so easy to fall off. Okay, this is pretty wet up. And I'm just going to get myself more stone swabs. This wood farm is almost done, but I have to just get a head start to put saplings in. More cobblestone slabs. I meant to say stone slabs. No, I meant to say two small slabs. It just keeps changing. I think this will be well enough to finish it off. And the last dirt wall will be over here. There we go. I could add walls for this farm later, but I think now just this farm does the job, and it'd be good to have trees spaced out all good because I get many weeds for a amount of sapling to grow. It's good that we've the cage back in the game, and with this tree farm, I usually get rows of wood. But now I think it's time to do some fixing with that mob farm. Yeah, I think I've got the stone slabs to do it. What problem will I fix first though? One problem is going to be harder. 
to do. What was that? I'm creeped out here. I'm building under there. I can dive in. Maybe it's just nothing, but it can't be nothing. I heard that noise. Maybe it's just nothing. I need to check how good the mob farm been doing. Nothing good. It doesn't really work yet. And see, I'm on hard mode. I need to break those wood planks. I should be water underneath. I made a mistake building this mob farm. I made it like three blocks too high, so I need to make it about three blocks lower. But I think I may need ladders to do the job. Good. I should have bought myself an axe to make this process easier, but I'm already there. I just need to keep going up and down the water. Make sure it's all filled so it's easy to make steps for it. I'm gonna drown. No. But the mob farm now deeper and the mobs are actually one hit punch killed now. I just need to make some steps. Maybe more steps than I thought. Because I'd be hitting mobs here. So. Yeah, shield of water axe. And I'm just gonna like keep mining because I do eventually give up. There's a crafting table there, why don't I just make an axe in the first place? But you know me. Sometimes I just think I need to walk back to the house to make an axe, but I didn't. I had a crafting table all the way there. Go down. Yeah, there's water there. So I need to fill this bit area with water. Breathe. Get more wood into me hot bar. Breathe again. And keep placing. Go back up. And continue on the steps. I think this could be enough. And it is. Or maybe not. You do one more. Where to place it? Here, I guess. Yeah. I think I might have a bit more wiggle room, so that's why I made it a bit more space. The mob farm I made before would have been disastrous because it wouldn't like make mobs one hit kill and also creepers would have blown me up so best to put the swabs here uh, no put the swabs into the wrong place again here yeah and switch to cobble place torch there so mobs don't spawn over here Yet the mob should be one hit killed now. And the second problem I need to fix spiders. Because with the mob form I have now, spiders will spawn, so I need to change that quick. But I have enough swabs to solve the problem. Do we hear anything? Yes I do. Maybe break one to see. Yeah, there's a creeper. Yeah, there's a creeper. Not fixing it now. I should have done that area. But maybe if I wait for a while, I could fix this problem. I think the creeper died. But over here, I can't really correct the drops. So I might need to go into the water and create myself more space. Breathe in. Yeah. Water resistance is annoying. 
ya. Can I correct it now? Yes, I can. I should do this on both sides as well. The second side was easier. Before fixing this, I should really make better armor because I could be destroyed by any second. So I think I need to go back to my base and create myself some better armor. Place torch there, yeah. Three trees have grown, so this shows that the tree farm is doing good. What can I maybe place some armor? Just wait in the middle wear it. Yeah, the bars are full now and fully protected. I think that one creeper was the only mob that only spawned in there ever. Because I was the first mob in mob farm to produce and it's been running for like minutes and minutes and end. But bear in modern version it does shoot out mobs because of no caves on the ground. No, there's not more mobs yet. Go back upstairs. I should really listen out on walking. I don't hear anything. I think it's safe. Temporary torches, just for sure. This is safe for getting the place to half swabs. Oh, but creeper doesn't spawn behind me and just kill me at instant. And I think I'm done placing the swabs. Now it's a big rush to get the torches. To any zombies that try to beat me, I got an axe. It's not 1.9 axe, but it's an axe. Yes, just be complete darkness now. Yeah, I will not get spiders from this farm, but I can always find a spider spawner in a future update and guess thing that way. To get with the spider falling will make this mob more consistent and more faster. And that's all I want. I like a consistent fast farm. I still seen a while she's to spawn at once, so okay, took adventures of the wool and I got twenty six now. Let me just see how many tree farms been doing. But before I go to the tree farm, I need an iron axe. Get there, there's some iron. And I'm just gonna collect some wood for my farm. Wow, what trees growing that time? It's almost full. What I'm going to use all this wood for, I don't know to be honest. I think I might have placed torches in the wrong place, yeah. But one thing I just got to say, you can't have a wood farm without a chest, so I'm just going to make myself a crafting table and a chest. Place it here, I think. Chest is facing the wrong way, but I placed it this way, but no biggie. Yeah, I'm making sapling profits here, yeah, even though what saplings are falling in the water. It's now the end of the episode, and the next part will be another Secret Friday update, and no more infidel. That's right, because Minecraft will start to go to the alpha stages now. And I was gonna mess around with minecarts and tracks in this episode, but they don't really work properly. The boosters weren't working, the tracks weren't connecting properly, so I just made the tree farmers dead. And I'm glad because the tree farmers producing loads of wood. And remember, new episodes of Minecraft 10 every 10 pm UK time, 2 pm Pacific time, 6 pm Atlantic time, Friday, and 7 am Australia time, Saturday. I'm telling you if the algorithm isn't. And bye. Outro.